What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today we're back on CB, our second Town Hall 12 and we're going to be working on getting some heroes going up today. We had the clan games recently end which has some lovely lovely rewards in there including like a rune of elixir or a book of heroes which I don't know which one I'm going to take yet and we got to kind of figure that out soon but there's a lot of great stuff in there and then we also finished off our gold pass uh, just by doing the daily challenges uh, today actually. We finish that off so some super positive stuff there uh so we got two books of heroes we can get that hero skin the pekka king unlock right there and we got a lot of good stuff going so i think i already have a book of heroes i do so we want to save those as much as possible uh but looking at the account we got a lot of good positive things going on and i want to start working on getting like these mortars upgrading so we're going to go ahead and drop down our first mortar with that uh all that gold we had left over and then we have enough elixir to go ahead and get our Grand Warden going. I probably shouldn't have started my boost yet, but oh well, that happens. Uh, so we'll go ahead and upgrade our Grand Warden with 9.6 million elixir. Then we'll go ahead and finish him off with a Book of Heroes. And then what we can do is we can kind of come in here and what we're going to do before we boost him back up is we're going to grab that elixir and then there's going to be a little bit of wasted elixir, not too, too much. A little bit of wasted elixir. We're going to go ahead and upgrade a wall right here. And then we're going to go ahead and pop off that rune of elixir right there. To go ahead and upgrade him again to level 33. Because we need to get him going up as much as possible. Uh, so with that being said, we can go in here. And we're actually going to save those two books of heroes. We're going to go in here and we're going to grab... Let's see, we're going to grab that because that's all we can get. We're going to grab the gems. We'll grab... We'll grab gems here. We'll go Book of... Ooh, what do I need in the lab? I think we still have our Golems to go up. Do we need... Yeah, we still have the Golems to go up, so we'll go Book of Fighting there. Book of Fighting that, that. Gems again. And then, like, I kind of want to go, like, uh, with a Rune of Elixir, but we definitely need that Book of Heroes. And then for this one, I guess we can go a little bit of Elixir right there. So we'll go ahead and collect our rewards and get us going. And that's a little bit of a nice start to the video before we get too much further because I, I forgot. I, I tend to do that. Let's answer today's comment question of the day coming from Damian Liu. Do you ever receive fan mail via social media or regular mail? Uh, I get a lot of positive stuff on social media, a lot of uh, positive outreach from fans, and I always love that kind of stuff. But I do have a P.O. box, which I don't ever really advertise, and I don't really ever get fan mail. I've gotten one... Maybe two letters in there uh, that are upstairs in my office. So if you guys do ever want to send like a letter, um, I'm not asking you to like send me stuff, but if you want to send me a letter, a super positive letter, uh, go ahead and send it to the P.O. Box right down there. Clash Bashing P.O. Box 1464, Grove City, Ohio, 43123. And it might get featured in a video or a stream or something like that. I don't know. Uh, I would love to get some letters from you guys and kind of see what you guys are thinking about the channel. Always good stuff. I mean, I read comments a ton also, so that's... Almost like fan mail. If you guys want to submit your own comment question of the day, hashtag CQOTD down there in the comments, and you might get featured in a video just like Damien did here today. So let's go ahead, and since we get that Book of Heroes, let's go ahead and upgrade our Warden, finish him off, level 33, and then we need to get a little bit of a Dark Elixir to get our Queen going up. We need about 18,000 to get her going up. We should actually be able to collect this now, and that'll allow us to grab that last book in there. We get a Power Potion. Uh, we'll eh, let's just go ahead and save that. The season's almost over. Uh, what else do we have in here? We have, ooh, we have another Rune of Elixir. I was unaware. So let's get enough gold to go ahead and upgrade another wall, or enough Elixir to upgrade another wall. And then we could do another level on our Warden. And then I want to get another level or two on the Queen. We might be able to max the Queen out today because what we have going on here is we have a Dark Elixir Rune in there. So we got a lot of positive stuff going on as far as hero upgrades go. Just going to take a little bit of farming in there. Is that enough? Oh, that's enough right there, guys. Uh, so we'll go ahead and grab that. And then we can go ahead and upgrade our warden. Oops, one sec. We're going to pop that elixir rune and upgrade our warden again. There we go. Warden down. And then we'll finish him off. And then we'll grab that last book of heroes. So not bad. We got a few levels on the warden. And then we're going to farm up. We're going to get the queen going. We're going to practice some queen walk miners today. Uh, I want to kind of practice this for maybe pushing. I'm kind of struggling and pushing right now. Uh, which I should have a video for that out tomorrow-ish, I would say. Uh, just a little bit of a busy weekend. My mom's coming into town and stuff. So we're going to go out. We're going to farm. We're going to see what we can do with this queen walk miners. We might even try some queen walk lalo. 
after we get our heroes finished up. I don't know. We'll see how things are going. I'll be back with our first raid here in a sec. Okay, so this is pretty decent of a test. I mean, it's not the best base, but it's a pretty decent little test of me getting into the center of a base because that's my biggest concern with this, but I don't know. I think it has some good potential. So we're going to go E-Dragon here. Uh, we'll let that kind of work for a sec. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can... Uh, wizard, I needed you to go the other way, bro. All right, let's get that going. I need the wizard to take out. All right, it looks like the e drag will take out that. Uh, what we call it? We're gonna go king here. I'm gonna get the ice golem going in. I'm gonna get that all working in here. Then we're gonna try to get the queen basically to go right up the middle. The ice golem did not follow the wrecker. That's okay. Ooh, did I not bring any poison or any freezes? Hmm. That might something be something to consider at a later date. So we got Valks in there. We definitely want to rage up the Valks as they come out of the clan castle. Um, oh, the king stole the healers. Nice. Awesome life, king. We're going to have to pop the queen's ability here. Oh, I missed her. Oh, my goodness, guys. See, this is my concern. Like, oh, I'm just not great with a queen charge. Oh, this is mildly infuriating. So, like, for the most part, everything's going to go around now. All right, I'm going to try to save the Dark Elixir. See, this is why I need to practice this stuff, but I am not that great with the Queen Charge. I think we need Freezes in here for sure. Go ahead and Rage, Heal. I think Rages will make things... Or not Rages, Freezes will make things a little bit better. I'm not saying that's going to solve it, but if we do run into singles, we're going to be able to get out of that. Uh, let's go ahead and hit the Warden's ability here. we got to just try to get as much of the Dark Elixir as possible. Let's get that all working there. Uh, we do have... Uh, there's, I shouldn't have healed up there. There wasn't enough in there worth healing. So there's the struggles, guys. That's... Uh, I'm just struggling as an attacker right now, I think. I think I need to practice, work on stuff. I don't know. Uh, the Queen Walk Miners with a super centralized town hall. I just struggled to get there. That's why I haven't committed to trying it like for the push. Uh, and then, like... The Witches, man, like... They're good for the most part, but I do leave some one stars on the table, and then I put up the wrong base on defense for today, so I've been getting beat up on defense. Ugh, it's rough, guys. It is rough. The The new push system is tough. It is definitely hard. Uh, we'll get here and get as much as we can, but we're going to have to improve. On, I'm going to have to learn how to get to the center of those bases. I'm going to take out one of the rages for two freezes, though, because I definitely think that's something that needs to happen. And then we'll kind of go from there. Okay, 85% two or one star rather. Uh, good dark elixir though. If there's any positive out of this, good dark elixir. We just need a little bit more uh, to get our queen going up. Okay, nice. All right, so let's go ahead and we'll work on that and we'll try to get our queen going up here after this next raid. All right, guys, we're struggling a little bit, but that's okay. That happens in the game. It's just I need to hit the FCs. I need to practice a little bit more and hopefully fix my struggles because I have not, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I've not been practicing attacks and it kind of shows. Uh, so if you guys ever go through a phase like this where you're just struggling to get a good attack in or you just, you just, everything's going wrong in every attack or at least it feels that way, hit those FCs in practice guys. It's, it's a good thing to hit those practices and uh, work on your skills. I know I definitely need to do that. So we're going to go into this heart base here. And we're going to get working. I'm going to let the E-Drag do his thing. E-Drag getting out some of the Dark Elixir there. We're going to take a risk and go away from the Dark Elixir there on that side right there. Actually, this is not necessarily what I wanted, but it's going to work. Uh, let's go ahead and get our Wrecker in here. We'll get our King. Look, our Queen is not going to charge in here the way I want her to. That's going to be the problem. Oh, I should have waited for the Ice Golem to kind of pop. Oh, well. Too late. He's going in. All right, let's go. Freeze here. Queen goes down. That's good. Oh, we barely missed that layer right there. All right, let's go ahead and get that. That ice golem is going to freeze all that stuff, which is going to be great. We might actually get to the town hall on this one. We'll see. We'll see what the queen decides to do here. Queen going around, around. There's no clan castle troops, which is great. Eagles going up. See, this is the kind of queen charge we need. A little bit better. Oh, we might not actually get the town hall down here. Go ahead and rage here. Keep her moving. And then while she's going, I think we're going to go ahead and start our miners because we're running out of time. 
So we're going to go ahead and get miners going in here. I don't like this miner entry, though. I will just say that to be clear. I'm not in love with this miner entry right here. All right, let's go ahead and throw our first heal down here. That might be a little bit early. But hopefully we can get this big group of miners here to go up into the center of the base. Let's go ahead and hit the Warden's ability there. Queen's working around. We're going to go ahead and throw a freeze right here. Queen! Oh my goodness, almost lost the queen, guys. Almost lost the queen. All right, we're out. We're all in on this one. Town Hall goes down. So we get the two star, which is good. We need to work on getting three stars with this, but we do get the two star. Uh, let's go ahead and throw that minion in there. Queen's doing her thing. And by doing her thing, I mean she's going to get taken out by that single. Unless the miners get it. Oh, the miners barely miss it. All right, miners, uh, they're not going to quite get healed. Oh, they might get healed. They might go. Go, miners, go. We need that last little bit there. There's that last little bit of Dark Elixir. I said we'll get the queen up on the next raid. I forgot it's 192, not 182. I'm, I'm kind of messing up here, guys. Uh, so we'll hopefully get her on the next raid because we're going to get a pretty substantial bonus on this one. We're not going to get a three star, but we still did a lot better on this one. A lot better than the last one. I'm still... I think I need to take into account like where I'm going to go in with the miners when I'm attacking because that was a little bit sloppy. 89% two-star is still way better, though. That's a step up. We got to hit one more to upgrade the queen. A decent little raid there. That wasn't too bad. We're making progress. Got to practice, guys. Got to hit those FCs, really. Got to get back in Mad Ram before CWL and hit those FCs. All right, guys. So I noticed on that last raid we got a star bonus. So we'll go ahead. That way we don't waste too much Dark Elixir. We'll go ahead and get that, and then we'll upgrade our queen right here. 192,000 Dark Elixir. Uh, we'll end her boost, and then we'll go ahead and use the Book of Heroes to get her going up. And then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and pop that Dark Elixir rune to get her up to level 65, which will be a max queen, and that's going to be really, really awesome. I don't think we have a book for that, though. We're going to have to gem her, right? Yeah. We don't have a book. There's no book in there, no book in there. Yeah, so we'll have to gem her up, but that's okay. We, we'll get her up 825, and then we'll reboost her and get moving. So not too bad there. We get the level 65 queen maxed out. Now let's go see what we can do with her. Okay, I feel like this one shouldn't be too bad to get to the center. We do have single infernos to kind of deal with, but I think we can work around that. So let's go ahead and keep it up. I should I should be looking for like more common push design style bases, I guess. Uh, but we'll see how everything goes. We're gonna let that E-Drag work here. I'm gonna throw my king in over here. I'm gonna throw that wizard. I wanted that wizard going. I, I equipped my P.E.K.K.A. skin because I forgot about that. Uh, so we do have our P.E.K.K.A. skin going. Uh, let's go ahead and get that right there. I'm going to throw in just one miner, maybe two miners right there. Uh, to make sure that that wizard tower goes down. Just to make sure our queen goes the right way. Oh, king taking a lot of flack. Let's go ahead and get our stone slammer working in there. See, that ice golem kind of comes in clutch there. Oh, no, I didn't mean to put the warden in there. I'm so used to doing, like, the uh, witch attack and whatnot and just throwing the warden in with everything. Uh, but that's okay. We'll be fine. Uh, let's go ahead and freeze right here. I need that wrecker to get through one more layer of walls. Perfect. That's exactly what we needed. We'll go ahead and freeze that. Let's go ahead and rage these Valks up to get that eagle down, just in case the queen doesn't get in there. All right. Queen! Oh, no, I, just, I hit the warden's ability and the queen's ability. Not what you want to do there. That's all right. Do we bring two poisons? Is that what happened? I think we brought two poisons instead of two freezes. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, let's go ahead and rage up the queen here. Because those balloons are going to be a pain in the butt. There we go. Queen, get the town hall down. And then we're going to go ahead and start our miners around this side, I guess, since uh, we w go ahead, went ahead and put the warden in with the queen. Ugh. You get so stuck in my ways, guys. All right, so we're definitely going to get a two-star here, which is good. Definitely need to secure those twos and be solid with them. But I think we're a little bit late on deploying stuff. All right, let's let these guys work for a quick sec. We definitely need to get some loot. We do have miners over there working. Let's go ahead and heal these guys right here. Queen's going to be under a little bit of fire right here from the king. I think she's going to be all right, though. That king's not going to do too, too much. Go ahead and put that one minion in there just to help try to funnel. Queen goes down. Our queen went down as well. So we're racking up percent, which is good. And that's what you really need to do during these pushing sessions is get as much percent as possible if you're not going to three-star. My main issue is I don't know, like, I feel like I'm not going to be great at three-starring with the miners. But I feel like that might be a decent little offset 
if we're two starring more often you know what i mean if we're not one starring it'll kind of balance itself out especially if we're getting like high percents like this i don't think that's always going to happen it's just ugh, i don't know guys we just got to work and get better I i'm i'm just struggling on the push and kind of like cussing myself out when i'm doing my push attacks i mean not always some of them are good some of them are bad but you know it's it's rough it's some of them are just really frustrating and i'm like i know i can do better what is going on 98% would be so frustrating if this was a push attack. There we go. 98% two star. We left a little bit of loot on the table there. Let's go ahead. Let's hit another one. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Let's try to find like a more of a push style base for that next attack. All right, guys, we got to try this one here. Uh, I feel like, ooh, I almost nexted that. I feel like we need to get that eagle out, but we also have to make sure we get the clan castle out. Oh, that's a little bit frustrating. All right, let's go. I got an idea. Let's go like this. Let's go E-Drag here. I also don't know. Like, I've seen people using, like, P.E.K.K.A.s to funnel on their uh, Queen Walk Miners. I don't know. That might be something to consider as well. All right, let's go. Balloon doing some work on that Wizard Tower. Wizard Tower goes down. We get a nice funnel there. Let's go ahead and get our Queen working in here. And put him in there. <laughs> Try to keep him away from everything. Get that working. The queen's gonna be able to charge in down there. Oh, king's coming back though. King, why are you coming back, man? Why are you doing this to me, king? All right, let's see what the king does. He's gonna go inside, which is okay. We can work with that. Uh, let's go ahead and rage up the wrecker right there. The Valks out of the wrecker, rather. They might actually even break through that wall for us, which would be sick. Uh, nope. Okay. So that's okay. We got... See, now our army's messed up again. We got three freezes on this one. Uh, let's go ahead. Right, if we got three freezes, let's let's go ahead and use them. Uh, let's get that working. We got plenty of time. We're going to absolutely destroy this one, guys. Let's go ahead and freeze that. We'll pop the queen's ability there. And then we'll go ahead and get... There's nothing in the clan castle. We'll get all of our miners going in here. And we should be pretty decent. Queen takes out the enemy queen. Nice. One shot right there. Uh, we'll go ahead. Let these miners work for a sec. So it's a little bit better. I mean, not necessarily the style of base I was looking for, but it'll work. It'll work one way or another. Let's go ahead and rage these guys up. Get them through here. Uh, since we do have that multi there, we'll go ahead and get that all working. We do have a multi on the back end also. There we go, multi's going down, miners are working. So I mean, that was better, but it was kind of a weaker base. I couldn't pass on the loot was the main reason I hit this, so it's whatever, guys, we'll, we'll be good. Let's go ahead and freeze right there, freeze up all those defenses. We just got four defenses froze. That's pretty clutch, uh, everything's in. We get that minion doing work over there by itself, and the miner's gonna get through here. They should be able to finish up and get through these last few defenses, I would think anyways. So, I don't know, maybe Queen Walk Miners might be the way to go. Queen Charge Miners, rather. But, I don't know, guys. I'm just... Ugh. It's so hard to, like, commit to the change, you know what I mean? Like, it's scary. Change is scary. But we do get the three-star there with some huge loot. Is that enough to upgrade anything? Uh, really, I just want to get uh, something going. It doesn't necessarily have to be a cannon or anything. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can get that going. We don't have the gear up available, so we can go ahead and upgrade that. The bomb tower being... That'll work. Get our bomb tower. That goes to max, right? Yep, that's going to be max level for the bomb tower, so we can go ahead and move that over. Not a bad episode. We got quite a bit of upgrades going. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a great day. Keep on Clash Bashing.